The European Space Agency's automated transfer vehicle has a crucial role in maintaining human spaceflight operations on the International Space Station, humanity's permanent outpost in space. Each ATV is named after a scientist or individual who fundamentally changed the way in which we understand the universe. And this series of films aims to examine these scientific breakthroughs and visionary concepts that made history. Now, after that dramatic reaction that we've just seen... And from here to here, it accelerated at over 160 G. That sounds pretty cool to me. The vortex has formed nicely. I'm going to kill the vortex by using my rulers in parallel. But the actual arrangement of baffles that we have in fuel tanks will depend upon the type of fuel that we have. Different liquids have got different viscosities. And no matter what orbit type we have, we can also see Kepler's laws in action here. The muon trails that we see in the tank owe their origins to high energy cosmic rays, protons this time, interacting with molecules in the Earth's atmosphere. So, here comes the match and she's survived. Now a similar thing happens with the Earth's magnetic field. The solar wind, the high energy protons and electrons, they're deflected by the Earth's magnetic field. 